Let's learn today borrow sums with negative answers. So let's practice these sums. 48 minus 38 directly minus 38 minus 46 minus 40 on the second rod is not possible. So I'll borrow one bead from the third rod or the fourth rod. It's up to us. But remember, if I borrow from the third rod, I will return to the third rod one bead back. And if I borrow from the fourth rod, I will return one bead back to the fourth rod. So let me take one bead on the fourth rod itself because it becomes easier for me instead taking every time one one bead from the third rod borrowing and again return it back. So I take from the bigger rod one bead and I'll return it one time itself. So now I will borrow one bead from the fourth rod and I will do minus 46. Minus 46 plus 6, close of which minus 10 and minus 6. I did this and minus 27, minus 20, minus 10. Now remember, before writing the answer, I need to return the bead back, which is not possible. It means the answer goes in minus. So we understood I cannot return, so I need to put the symbol minus. And when it is minus, you will not read the abacus 937. You will read the abacus, the beads which are not touching now. That is your zero beads are not touching, your six beads are not touching, and your two beads are not touching. But the rule is in each place not touching plus one. That is not touching two plus one, three. Now let's do one more time. Ninety-eight. Minus twenty-six. Minus 89. Let me borrow from the fourth rod itself. Minus 80. Minus 9. Minus 90. Minus 7. Minus 48. Minus 40. Minus 8. Now I cannot return one bead back. The answer goes in minus. When it is minus, read the bead which is not touching. 1, 1, 1, 6 not touching and plus. 1, 6, 1 is not touching, the rule is in unit place, not touching, plus 1. That is 2, 1, 62. Now, moving to the next last question, 12, minus 63. Let me borrow from the fourth rod. Let me try borrowing from the third rod once. Now, borrowed one B on the third rod. So, borrowed one B to remember, okay? Now, Minus 60, minus 3. Now minus 42, possible. Now minus 89 again is not possible. So again I will go to the third rod and borrow one more bead. That is minus 89. Borrowed and to remember that I borrowed two times. Minus 80, minus 9, minus 56. Again I will borrow one bead. Now I can do minus 50, minus 6. Now, to return on this rod, how many bees have taken? I have borrowed three times. So now, if you take this way three times, the rule on this rod is minus one. Borrowed three times minus one, that is minus two. And we are not touching B is three. And we are not touching B is seven. And the rule is plus one. Seven plus one is eight. This is how the negative Sums 